Good morning. It is a little chilly. Good morning, your freezing morning. But yeah, good freezing morning. Yeah, it's a little, a little chilly. Um, I'm going to be driving the boys to school. They are ready. Just have to get their boots and coats on, and I have to deal with this. <laughs> yes, get that frost off, and then we will be ready and on our way. So yeah, the hubby didn't sleep too good last night. Okay, I want to get the scraper, and so he is catching up on some Z's. Why don't you want to open? Hang on. Try that again. Open sesame. Woo, it worked. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to get the frost off. And the coffee is ready to go. I just have to push the most important button in the house when we come home. <laughs> yes, it'll, it will be waiting for us to push the button and it will brew and... We will wait patiently for a cup of coffee, yeah. Anyways, bippity boppity boo. Car is scraped off. Backpacks acquired. I just need two hobbits. <laughs> AKA my boys. Oh. And then we'll be ready to go on this Monday morning. It's actually not too, too chilly. I think yesterday was a little bit colder, so not too bad. There's one, one hobbit, no. Mr. Casey. One, one taco. One taco, taco is a snoozing. <laughs> She's where it's nice and warm. And as usual, waiting for Henry. Yeah. <laughs> He's um, probably making a pit stop like most men do. Before you leave the house, you gotta yeah, go to the bathroom. Yeah, dad does it too. Yeah. Every time, doesn't fail. Yeah, oh. every time you leave the house. Oh. One second. It got is that is it that cold? Yeah. Yeah, you can see your breath. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know it's a Monday <laughs> when you make it to the school just on time, and I mean right on time, few minutes to spare. But we weren't the only ones, <laughs> so yeah. And, and we woke up on time and. We were doing good until Mother Nature called, you know, and yeah, you have to make a couple of um, bathroom pit stops, and yeah, that's what did it. <laughs> oh, but, but we made it, they're at school, and now we can um, go home and have a cup of coffee, and yeah. <laughs> oh, that will, that would be good, yes. <laughs> It's so quiet. <laughs> it's nice. <laughs> mm. So if you're having a cup of coffee or tea, enjoy. Cheers. Here's the wonderful day. Wonderful start of the new week. Oh, that's good. Good way to start is a cup of coffee. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's just it's nice and quiet because like the hubby's sleeping and I'm Guessing that's where Lois is too, upstairs snoozing, and Taco is snoozing, and I think I missed the memo. <laughs> I should be snoozing too, yeah. <laughs> but once I'm up, I'm up, and it's very hard for me to go back to sleep, yeah. <laughs> that's the only downside. I wish I could, yeah, but I can't. Mm, but it's good coffee. Mm. Oh, you can't see him. I got Mickey Mouse. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Big Mouse himself. Uh, yeah, so you, you, you know when it's Monday, eh? It's like, oh my gosh, like, seriously. And we were doing good until, like, nature decided to call. And it's like, the boys had to go to the bathroom. I was like, oh my gosh, yeah. But but what, what can you do? Because you can't help it, you know? Because when you, when you gotta go, you gotta go, right? Like, yeah. But we made it just in time, yeah. And there, they'll be good. <laughs> I was like, whew, okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, even if we were late, it just would have been a couple minutes. So, yeah. Uh, oh, and I watched my next Disney movie last night. I watched Dinosaur, made in 2000. 
Um, I remember watching this one. Yeah. Um, so it, it's it's about this. It first opens up at like this nesting area. All these dinosaurs have their nest, and um, this one lonely egg is on its own because the nesting area got attacked by a big dinosaur. Not a T Rex, um, but another one, I don't know. <laughs> a meat eater dinosaur. Um, probably a relative of the T Rex, yeah. Um, but um so this this lonely egg ended up um with the lemurs and they adopted him and um and then they had to flee because there was a meteor shower and then they found a whole bunch of other dinosaurs that were finding their way back to the valley um and so but they met some you know some hard times right you know finding water and trying to stay away from people I mean, I'm dinosaurs, other dinosaurs that want to eat you. Um, so, yeah, try, just pretty much trying to survive. Trying to survive. And one, well, a couple of the voices that I recognized right away, okay, was um, Della Reese. She voiced a Triceratops. And we all, all know Della Reese, Touched by an Angel. Oh, love her loved her she's passed away um and i love that show touch by nato too that's such a good show too and um yeah and then she she has like a really nice you know soothing voice to listen to and and it's just a, a recognizable voice right away oh i know who that is right and then the other one i recognized was julia mark what's her last name mark oh from, from er she plays carol hathaway on er um julia um, I can't think of it right now because I'm just going to butcher it. I can, I can picture it, but, um, Margulies, something like that, Margulies. Um, she voiced the love and trust of the or orphan dinosaur that the lemurs adopted. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. She has, she has a recognizable voice too. Like, you know, it's like, oh, even though I'm watching ER and of course, like, you know, I know her voice and it's like, but it's, it's still recognizable. It's like, oh, I know who you are. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, uh, so yeah. So that was a good movie. It was um just over an hour and twenty minutes, I think. Very short, but yeah, very good. And um, I forget what my next one is. Um, yeah, I forget. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to think, but I can't remember. I know. Uh, yeah, but that, I think it, I think that's when the movies were good. Whereas was in the '90s and like the early 2000s. Movies back there were so good. They were. Like, today they're so different. They are, uh, I don't know. They're remakes after remakes after remakes. And it's like, okay, enough of the remakes. We get it. I know. And, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. But, yeah, that, that was good. And I think today, um, I definitely will watch a couple episodes of ER. I did not get to watch one yesterday. Um, Saturday I did, so I need to get my ER fix in. Watch a couple episodes or two and um, tidy up, just do a general tidy up of the living room, room because, well, it was the weekend, but it's not as bad as it usually is, so that's good. And just continue on my cleaning spree because I've been kind of getting a head start on spring cleaning while I can because once spring gets closer, I get too busy with outdoor stuff and getting outside ready for spring, getting our garden ready for spring. And we will be busy because our front garden needs attention. And we kind of neglected it last year because of everything we're going through. The hubby had surgery and it was just like not the right time, not the right year to be worrying about the outdoor stuff. The, um, the inside of the house was a lot more important keeping up with the inside of the house. You know, the outside was like, you know, as long as the grass was cut, that's all we cared about pretty much that's all that mattered and um the inside of the house taking care of that was plenty so and I didn't need to worry about it and I didn't need to add anything more to my overflowing plate you know and worry about the outside so but this year um hopefully with no surgeries you know we're good you know get these add two surgeries within a year um, hopefully this year is a, is a no surgery year. Um, although Henry, I think, is still going to get surgery on his toe. We're still waiting for a doctor to call. He has a wart on his toe. 
Um, and it doesn't look as bad, like, because he got the stuff that he got sprayed with that stuff, um, liquid nitrogen. And it did, like, the scab did fall off, but you can tell the wart is still there. So we're just waiting for the doctor to call. And, um, yeah, but I think it's because it's like, it's not like, you know, an emergency, you know, we're not, you know, if it was an emergency, we'd hear from like right away. So, but I'm um, hoping pretty soon. Uh, but that would be just a minor surgery, so like no major, no major surgeries, you know. And it, his toe is looking, you know, it's looking pretty good. Like it's not looking any worse or anything like that. So, but um, yeah, everything is, you know, good and that area. It's all under control. And yeah, so um, we're just waiting. We're playing a waiting game. <laughs> um, I might have the hubby call, you know, this week just to, you know, check in. We might do that. So. Um, but yeah, as long as we don't have like any major surgeries, you know, but like once spring does come and like we can get out outside and get the front yard looking, well the garden, we don't have a front yard, but like the front garden, um, looking top shape and looking nice, you know, and that is one of our goals for when spring comes. And so that's why I'm trying to get a head start of doing like everyday cleaning that I always do, but also doing cleaning that I don't do every day. You know, I only do like once or twice a year, like wiping the stains off the walls you know well like going through like the walls like if i see a stain on the wall okay yeah i'll wipe it off but there are some stains i don't even notice that they're there until like i'm cleaning a room and i'm going through it to, you know moving furniture and like you know doing that kind of deep cleaning and then it's like oh, okay and then while i'm doing while i'm here i'll clean it and i'll have clean walls for like two minutes you know <laughs> like, yeah and, and cleaning the baseboards you know my baseboards i haven't done in a couple years so doing that kind of cleaning and so I did a living room and I did like you know the mud room a quick I just needed to do a quick tie up in the mud room because I did that for Christmas and then I did the toy area and now I'm at the bathroom I want to clean the bathroom and go through everything that we have underneath the sink and on the shelves anything that's expired toss you know just do that kind of cleaning and anything that we don't use I just sit in there collecting dust and you know toss or you know whatever and yeah do that so that's next and then i'm working my way over this way yes this area will get cleaned next and then the kitchen now the kitchen i did like declare the kitchen last summer so i don't really have to go through the cupboard so i might just do a quick tidy up um but i do want to like pull out the appliances and like that kind of stuff pulling up the appliances i only do once a year okay so yeah i think most people do that once twice a year um, so I do want to do that and like sweep and clean behind there and mop for two. So yeah, I'm dreading that, but <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> I don't want to do that. But um, yeah, just doing that kind of cleaning that doesn't get done all the time. Yeah, well I still can because once, you know, March comes and spring is around the corner, I won't, I won't get any of that done. I'll be too busy. Yeah. Yeah. So, um... Oh, oh, and Linky Box GMEs update. Um, so I bought the boys Linky Box GMEs for Christmas presents and super excited. And they were super excited to get them. Um, I was not super excited when the, the first time putting them on that day, the tail of the GMEs was because they're foxy GMEs and they're onesies and they um have a tail and the tail was falling off and then there was a hole and I was not happy because you spend good money and you expect to like get a good product a, a good item and it was like it can't I, I don't know if it was just um you know a de like like you got one that was kind of defect in it I don't know maybe that could have been it um and Casey's has a hole and a tail falling off and I thought okay well I have to look at Henry's because Henry hasn't really worn his because it's been too warm it hasn't been cool enough but Casey lives in his okay he lives in it he always wants to wear it um if he could wear it to school he would in fact he did wear it to school on Friday because they had a loony license day but it was a free loony license day and a loony license day is like a little bit like six activities for them to choose from you pay a loony um, but this was a free one, so I didn't have to pay. I'm like, okay, great. And I think it was just his, his class that did it, so it was his teacher. Probably because it was like the first week back 
of school back to school from holiday break you know it's kind of okay that's it's kind of nice to do right um and he picked where you jam me so he did wear them um i did stitch everything up i even stitched that morning okay the tail was falling off again and i stitched it that morning and of course when he came home it was coming off again because my stitching is not the best okay it's it, it's it's not like i don't know i i need to learn how to stitch but um i don't know it's just like i do the best i can but if i had a sewing machine i could fix it but I don't, so it's like hand stitching it is. So, so um, I love to review, you know, two or five stars. Now, I should have probably contacted the company and done it that way, but because I was so upset, because I was so ticked, you know, because it was a Christmas gift, and it started to show signs of, you know, you know it was falling apart that day. Like, he had it on probably for, like, you know, like, an hour. Like, it wasn't long, you know? And I was like, are you kidding me? Like, n no. <laughs> you know, you spend that much money? And, like, no. 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 So, I went, uh, I just, you know, left a review. They must have saw the review. They got touch me with me. They emailed me. And um, they said we can, um, we want to make a right. And we could... Um, refund you or send replacements. So I'm like, I'll take, you know, replacements because the boys do love them. And uh, thank you so much. You know, I appreciate it. Appreciate it because uh, a company that does that, that wants to fix a problem, you know, because I, I, and I did send them pictures to show proof. Um, a company like that, you know, is owning up. Okay. Our bad, you know don't know how it happened and it could have been just a fluke it could have been my just two pairs you know i'm sure not every pair of lanky box onesies does that but it could have been you know i could have been just unlucky in the pick right and uh but they they're fixing it so kudos i like a company that does that you know and fixes it and and actually cares about their product and you know when their customers you know get the product you know and if something is wrong they want to make it right so i like that i appreciate that and yeah so that's where we are with that so i'm glad it'll be settled and they should be getting it um i don't know i think when i ordered it the first time it took i think it took a couple weeks so yeah anyways i think that's all i have to say I know this coffee chat's going on 15 minutes, so I might better <laughs> hurry up and, uh, yeah, I know it's like, woo, before you know it, it's like, there's a vlog. <laughs> uh, hope you don't mind. <laughs> Chit chatty Monday. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'm going to enjoy my cup of coffee and, um, clean the one room in the house nobody wants to clean. <sighs> the bathroom. I know I dry to clean the bathroom. I clean it. I clean it every week, and I I just I, I dread it. You know I dread it. I just do. It's just boys are gross. Okay, boys, boys are gross, and they do not know how to aim all the time. You know, so it's like yeah, <laughs> they're stormtroopers. They do not know how to aim. <laughs> So it's much later on in the day. It is going on four o'clock. The boys are home. I'm doing chicken nuggets for Henry. Just waiting for them to finish up in the oven. And um, for us, we're having meatloaf. I decided to do it in a muffin tin. I haven't done it that way for a while. And I got potatoes going right now for mashed potatoes. So looking pretty good. Um, I got a lot done in the bathroom, cleaned the bathroom, cleaned the living room. And I didn't get to organize underneath the sink or the shelves in the bathroom. I'm going to do that tomorrow because cleaning it and like mopping the floors. And I also mopped the door. <laughs> Cleaned off the door front and back and the doorway with the mop before I mopped the floor. So I did that and I did like the baseboards and the bathroom looks really nice and now if if there was one area i could put caution tape it would be the bathroom <laughs> do not enter you know i just cleaned it if you enter and you make a mess you in big trouble okay <laughs> yeah so that is done and the living room didn't take me long just just a quick tidy up and i watch a few episodes of er probably around four you know <laughs> four yeah okay four uh, <laughs> listen <laughs> I did I did I did not expect to get 
hooked on ER because when I first started watching it, and I realized, oh yeah, that, like, I knew there was quite a few seasons, um, but I didn't realize that there were 15. And it's like, okay, I have time, you know, there's 15, I was taking my time, and I didn't realize that ER would suck me back in, and yeah, <laughs> I can't seem to get enough, I watched like quite a few episodes, yeah, but, you know, I was cleaning, so, you know, doing two things at once, cleaning and watching, yeah, um, <laughs> or when I took a break after doing all that work in the bathroom, making the bathroom look pretty, you know, yeah, <laughs> oh, no. oh, and I watched my next Disney movie, too, um, it was only over an hour, probably the same length as dinosaur movie um hour 20 30 minutes fantasia 2000 now i was kind of nervous about starting this one because the original fantasia i don't really like i was falling asleep i found it boring um this one was a little bit better i think only because they had steve martin and bette midler and angela lansbury mrs potts herself um just introducing you know the next song that they were doing and yeah it was it was cute but i probably wouldn't you know if it was like among a list of movies to choose from to watch Let's just say I probably wouldn't pick it. No, um, it, and it, and it did have Sorcerer Mickey, and it had Noah's Ark. Um, you know the guy with the big boat. I like big boats, and I cannot lie. <laughs> and that one was actually Donald Duck and Daisy. Um, Noah had Donald Duck round up two of every animal. Well, they were already rounded up, but he had him get him get. Get the animals into the ark. Be right back. I'm back. The hubby was calling. <laughs> um, so, I forget what I was saying. Um, Donald Duck. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, he had to get the animals on to the ark. So, that, that was, you know, cute. But, you know, yeah. It was okay movie. And uh, the next one I start to watch it, I start to watch it, it's, I'm only 10 minutes into it, is The Kid with um, Bruce Willis. And I think that was 2000, the year 2002, so yeah, that's my next one. So, But now I'm just waiting to have the oven free for the meatloaf. This will take about 30 minutes. Um, and in about 3 minutes, this will be going in. Yeah, I'm just going to toss it in. That's it, toss it in. <laughs> Dinner is served. Um, and as you can tell, the vegetables are still steaming hot. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's dig in. I am hangry. What? Meat yo. Did you come to to take a bite of my meatloaf? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't even get the first bite I get the second bite <laughs> uh huh mm. 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 alright that's good mm -hmm. alright I'm going to enjoy this. Um, <laughs> eat up every little bite. Hopefully, I have leftovers tomorrow, but leftovers are never promised. <laughs> no. Mm. I can do it. I can do. I can put beans in caca corn. Yeah. And do my mac and yeah, potatoes. Yeah, you can. Your potatoes. And according to Casey, I make good meatloaf, so, yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. I do. The only thing I didn't put in it was cheese. I usually will put, like, um, a slice of cheddar, cheddar cheese, but he, Casey doesn't like cheddar cheese. And I did not have any uh, mozzarella. I've used, like, shredded mozzarella before. <laughs> Um, but I don't have any, so but that's okay. It's good with or without it. Mm-hmm. 
All right, guys, so thanks for hanging out with me today. I hope everyone had a wonderful Monday. I'm going to finish eating. And I have some dishes that need to be done. And yeah, it never ends, does it? No, but that's okay. <laughs> um, if, only they, if only they washed themselves, like in Beauty and the Beast, you know, and put themselves away, that would be good. You know, I, I would I would approve. I think everybody would approve, and everybody would want that in their house, right? Dishes that wash and put themselves away. And while we're at it, let's get laundry to do that too, please. Yeah, okay, come on. Why can't it be exactly like in the movies? <laughs> mm hmm If only I could. Mm hmm mm hmm mm Alright, I will see you guys in the next fun video. Take care, be blessed, and as always, ta-ta for now. Bye!